Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this video is going to be about multi-page view, but I'm sorry to say it's only available in the newest Corel Draw as of right now, 2021. But the other day we were doing some cutting and pasting, and if you had something off your page and you cut it or you copied it and you tried to put it on page three and you paste it, it's going to put it way out there, and if you just happen to be zoomed in, you would never see it. So I started thinking about, and I've got everything highlighted that they changed. So in 2021, you have multiple page view. The good thing about this, when this is off the page, you can see it, and let's just put it there. But let's say we want a blue one over here. All I have to do is hit the plus key on the keyboard, and I can put it over there, and I can actually hit P and put it in the center of the page. Or if I want to swap and I want the blue one on this page and that one. So you can swap between pages and then when you still go to take away the multi-view page, you're on page four, page three, page two has that circle in the center and page one is that white or that red dot. So if you go to view, multi-page view, you can do a lot with this. Uh, I, with what I do, I don't use it but you could really, really, you could uh, control A, select everything on that page, make a duplicate of it, you know, put it over here, and um, better just move stuff around, almost like you had four monitors set up in four different pages of Corel Draw. And you can have as many as you want. You can have keep adding and adding, and then if you want, this one on page two, just move it up there, page three, page four, you know, select all this and move it over here. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.